All right, taking a look at crude oil, we have a bullish reversal in crude, which points to higher prices. But first, a quick word from our sponsor. This video is brought to you by Exynos, the world's largest retail broker, offering ultra-fast execution with no overnight fees. Please find the link in the description below. This is Bruce Graphex Empire taking a look at the daily chart for crude oil. So you have to kind of back up for a second for those of you who may be new to this analysis. We have a breakdown of a symmetrical triangle that triggered in the beginning of September. The bottom line here, the top line here. Break out, you can see it a little better, maybe. And that subsequently led to a potential failure of the breakdown as price rallied back into the pattern and almost challenged the top line right here. So then it broke down back through below the uh, the pattern again, and now it is unclear what is going to happen as far as the symmetrical triangle breakout. Either it's going to be breakdown i should say it's going to either be a failure and rally and break out through the top or it's going to be a continuation and continue to fall whether that happens before price moves back into the pattern or not remains to be seen but right now let's look at the shorter term pattern which is a bullish breakout of this inside day off key support at the 78.6 percent fibonacci retracement along with the completion of an a b c d pattern where symmetry between the two swings symmetry and price between the between the two swings marks a potential pivot point and it looks like that pivot point is there and it is holding you can see the purple 20 moving average and orange 50 moving average those are just below the 38.2 percent fibonacci retracement which completed with today's advance that means that a rally above today's high 72.96 puts crude in place to test the 74 09, 74, 10, 50 percent retracement area and resistance at the bottom of the symmetrical triangle, this line right here. So we'll be watching that very closely to see whether it's going to continue to be resistance, meaning that it may eventually then turn back down, or it's resistance and then there's a breakthrough, which means it may challenge these higher levels and potentially the top of the symmetrical triangle eventually. Okay, that is it for Crude Oil Traders. Have a great week. All right, we've got a continuation of the rally in gold into new record highs, and it continues to trade at the high of the day. But before we get started, a quick word from our sponsor. This video is brought to you by Exynos, the world's largest retail broker, offering ultra-fast execution with no overnight fees. Find the link in the description below. This is Bruce for FX Empire, taking a look at the daily chart for gold. So you can see that the uptrend continued following a potential bearish day yesterday and gold is on track to close above yesterday's high 2741 is yesterday's high it's currently trading at 2747 so as long as it closes above yesterday's high higher prices look to be in sight the next target whether it becomes something or not remains to be seen is at 2754 which is a 250% extended retracement of this prior correction here from the two, March 22 high. So we go down, we ex retrace all the way 100%, and then up to a 250%, which is up here, uh, and that is the next level where we're just about to approach here. Whether that uh, finds resistance or not remains to be seen. It's not a... Uh, Fibonacci number, as you might be aware, but many times two and a half is an area where we see some signs of resistance. The next, uh, the next level above that is a zone from 2797 up to 2815. 2815 completes the bull flag target. Basically, we're taking the bull flag from when momentum kicked in from this, from this uh, high right here to this high and attaching it to the breakout level to arrive at 2815 maybe it gets it maybe it doesn't but since it is joined by a couple other key long-term fibonacci extension levels 
uh, we have a nice high probability, I would say, resistance zone uh, right up there. Whether gold goes straight there or not remains to be seen, of course, and so far it looks like it could, but we'll have to watch closely. Okay, that is it for gold traders. Have a good week. Thank you.